I've written a travel piece for the Sunday Telegraph, which involved driving a 31-year-old Ford Fiesta XR2 from Rochester in Kent on the Medway to South End on Sea on the Thames Estuary, taking in Canby Island. It was quite a trip, really. Good fun. Um, and I met a musical legend on the way. Anyway, I've made a little video showing what it was like. Well, here we are outside Gate 20, Ford's Dagenham engine plant, where it also has its fleet of heritage vehicles. And uh, I'm having trouble actually getting everything in shot because I don't know what I'm doing. Never mind. Uh, this is a 1989 Fiesta XR2, which is the sort of sporting one. It costs about eight grand. This is a, a driving experience of its time. This is the noise that generations of gentlemen of a certain age in the Romford area would have heard. And here we are in the Medway town of Rochester. Greetings from the A127, where we're thrumming along at a steady 50 miles an hour. Um, yes, to deep the Essex. I'm rather enjoying it. Well, here we are. Venice-like wonder that is Canvey Island. Waiting to meet a gentleman whose uh, real name is John Martin, but who's better known as the big figure, original drummer from Dr. Feelgood. He turned out to be a lovely bloke and great fun as an interviewee. But if you want to find out what he actually said, well, I think you'll have to read the piece. Dot, dot, dot. Meanwhile, it was back on the road. Well, here we are in South End. We've made it, having traversed the joy that is the A127, which goes on for quite a long time in a straight line, then arrives at South End and seems to go on for just as long, and then you follow signs to the seafront, get lost, and ask a traffic warden um, who uh, tells you to hang a left on several occasions, and here we are. It's out of season, relatively few places to buy an ice cream, but never mind if it was time to go and search some chips. <laughs> 